Super. Smashing great. It's that time again. It's the Irish Ground Weekly Preview Show. And for our regular followers, we hope you have been enjoying the preview by myself and Dan. And we also hope you have been watching our six-pack. We hit top form with five out of six winners last weekend. So if you didn't watch it, it's very much a case of look what you could have won. So it's time to get the preview underway for another week. And we will start off by mentioning the Arrows Cross Track Bookmakers Puppy Derby, which gets underway on Friday night and will be the pre-derby meeting point for many attending this year's derby. A few to look out for in this year's event will be Ovex Sean, Dreamwalker, Bling Bling Buzz, Westmead Maldini, Westmead Melody, Blonde Ross, Fast Fit Tiger and Kingo. We will have a more in-depth look at the Puppy Derby in next week's preview as well as looking ahead to the 2010 Irish Laurels in Cork. But we do of course move on to the big event of the year in Irish Greyhound Racing and we see the 2010 Labrooks.com Irish Greyhound Derby down to the final six. After five weeks of hard work it all comes down to one race. We will save the Derby final for a little later in the preview as we have one of the best supporting cards you will ever see on show on Saturday night and it has attracted and expected the best of what Ireland has to offer. Racing gets underway at 7.30 on Saturday night and it's certain that it will be standing room only when the final comes around at 9.30. But we'll be trying our best on the preview to give our followers a bit of money in their pocket to stick on the final. In the opening race, Tyra Alice looks a leading danger but is the only bitch in the field and will be facing a tough test from Forest Raven and Feet on Fire in a competitive opening race. Our selections are 4, 2 and 5. The second race sees some of Ireland's best two-bend performers in action, with Yes Boss, the winner of the Peggy Kelly, Sheet Walk Mike, National Sprint Champion, and Carolos Pride, all going into battle in the Dash Stakes. Rab and Liz McNair, are also making the trip over for the Derby and have King Lee running in this dash, which could see a British winner on the cards early on. Selections here are four, five and two. The third is an interesting affair with some nice looking stayers coming on shore. Cover up, a recent state winner in Thurlers, will be looking to return to her best form in the Open 750 affair. Black balls down and Cool Model look to have a say in proceedings, whilst Killahorny Tina also looks an interesting recruit to the 750 ranks and is taking a big step up from her Mullingar form. Selections here are 6, 4 and 3. Race 4 sees the bitches in action, and what a race this is. We have the English Oaks winner, Shaw's Dilemma, Newbridge Oaks winner, Ballymac Mitzi, Irish Oaks finalist and Tipperary Cup finalist, Shelburne Dawn, all in action along with Millie Marina making this a real special affair in store. Shaw's dilemma could be a leading danger if back to her sparkling best and warrants respect. Shelburne Dawn however looks the leading player in this field as she appears to be banging form at the moment and will take holding on her Newbridge form. Ballymac Mitzi has struggled in her last couple, but should be a different lady when entering back into the bitches category. Miller Marina, who picked up a heat of this year's derby, makes a return to Ireland with Andrew Clark and looks banging for him, and will have a lot to say if blasting from the traps in the same manner she did on August the 14th. Selections in this ladies' event are 2, 4 and 6. Farley Turbo had the keyboards in action last weekend following his flying trial in 28.03, which is inside the six-year-old 525 track record in Shelburne Park. Of course, it cannot be broken on account of it only being a trial, but what a run. Drawn in track one on Saturday night, he faces opposition from the likes of champion stakes winner, Makeshift, who is looking to make a big time return to form following his derby exit. We have internet warrior Mona Lee Alsatian, who looks super in this year's derby, while Oran Legend and Westmead Grant also provide us with some super action in what looks a mouth-watering encounter, and will be something special to watch. Selections here are one, two and four. 
The seventh race sees the 2010 Derby Consolation Final and sees a race which looks exceptional to watch. Foil Storm did the Trial States winners proud in making it to this year's semi-finals and would look like a lady to watch in the Newbridge Oaks if making her way there or possible the champion bitch stake in Thurlers later in the year. Colourful Champ and Macedo Blue are likely to dominate the betting in this field and what looks like a super battle in the making. Both are able to fly from traps and we could see a real battle between these two as they go down the back straight. Selections in this one are 1, 4 and 3. Of course it's then on to the Derby final, but we will give that just a quick skip for the moment and move on to what could be the race of the night outside of the Derby final. It is of course the ninth race and the much anticipated Open 750, which sees Ireland's finest in action. We have some of the best dogs in Ireland over 750 trip going into action. Recent national record breaker Kiltree Kev will be one of the headline grabbers but will be facing opposition from big hitters such as Cool Derry Fizz, Ferdy Abound, Corporate Attack and Group Skater. This is so good we could make a film out of it with so many stars in action. Kiltree Kev looks the leading player and clocked 28.59 for the 525 last week behind Farley Turbo which for any 525 ground is moving but for a 750 ground it's exceptional. Group Skater ran well in defeat to the six pack tip Tyra Hender last week and will be one to watch in this affair. Selections which are not easy for this one are six, three and four. Race 10 is the Derby Plate final and we'll see an open affair with any of the six in this field in with a chance of the €4,000 winner's prize. St Louis Spirit met trouble last time up and should be a player in this final if avoiding trouble. Westmead Bolt and Ballyfeard Brave would also warrant watching if getting into the mix early on. Selections here are 6, 1 and 2. The 11th race is over the 575 trip and may give a good guide to the upcoming Open 575 which follows the Derby each year. Crash Bandit produced a massive run last week to record 31-37. Jim said so and Greenwell Viper looked to form the main opposition in this event and could go very close if getting away very smartly. Selections here are 1, 3 and 4. So we will now move on to the big one. The 2010 Labrooks.com Irish Greyhound Derby and what a final it promises to be. Six greyhounds do battle for €120,000 and the prestigious title of the 2010 Irish Derby Champion. Tyra Big Mike has been in exceptional form on his way to the final and will be going into the traps the favourite on Saturday night. He looks to face main trouble from his own kennel companion, Tyra McGuigan, who has been flying from traps of late. The two Tyra dogs could be disputing the lead into the opening corner. Krug95 is the 10th finalist for trainer Fraser Black and could be a danger if getting a clear run, which he's still to receive in this year's derby. Don't forget he made the English derby final, so that's a great achievement. Tully Murray Act, drawn on the fence, faces the hardest test of being drawn on the rails and being the furthest from the air as the derby roar goes into action. But we can't rule out the defending champion's kennel, as he will be at his best for the final, and being the sole inside seed in this year's final may just work to his advantage. Burfoot Buller has a flying finish in his arsenal and could be in the right place if avoiding trouble from the fast starting Tyra Purr going into the bend. But by no means least, we have Phyllis Beg Joker, who was a tip of ours back to make it to the final and he has done just that made his way through to make it into this year's final. Likely to be an outsider, but will have plenty to say if getting into the mix. Our selections here are 4, 3 and 1. So folks, that's it for this week's preview on this year's Derby final night. And we would just like to wish all the runners in this year's final the best of luck and may they all come back safe. And that goes for all the runners on Derby final night. For all our followers who are heading over, we wish you the best and hope you make lots of money in this year's final. Which brings us nicely on to this week's six pack. This week's six pack. It's time for me and Dan to peel off the tops and to the delight of our female followers, show off this week's six pack. Number one, Tyra Big Mike to win the Derby is our nap. 
Number two, Cool Model to win race three. Number three, Shelburne Dawn to win race four. Number four, Farley Turbo to win race five. Number five, Colourful Champ to win the consolation final. That's Mix, Sparkling Ring Pull. Number six, Killtree Kev to win race nine is our next best. Good luck. I hope they're lucky for you. Five out of six last week. Can we get six out of six this week? We're going to try.